Ron's wet weather return in areas that we don't want to see it. We're watching areas around Alachua County, also Union, Bradford, and Clay County, but it's Alachua, Clay, or Alachua, Putnam, and Columbia County that continue with the flood watches and more rain expected overnight tonight and into the start of your finally Friday. And we're watching the tropics. Tropical Storm Brett, still 65 mile an hour storm here. The update will come in at 11 o'clock with the very latest St. Vincent, St. Lucia, and the uh, central part of the Lesser Antilles will pick up the brunt of the storm overnight tonight and into early Friday before it starts to put some distance between it and the islands as we make our way through the day. And then strengthening also and becoming a tropical storm. Once it gets a name, this will be a historical storm because it'll be two storms in the month of June during a hurricane season, which is absolutely unheard of. And yes, there is more rain tonight. So instead of the words, let's just take you through the activity. I-75 areas of Alachua County, Union, Bradford and Clay, as we're currently seeing, and that is as of nine o'clock in the evening, scattered activity overnight tonight, and then ramping up once again, I-10, US 90, I-75, even portions of I-95 will see some showers and storms. And yes, that does affect the early morning commute. The models have been fantastic here, bringing what was the, what has been the wet weather through the morning and early part of the um, midday drive within some breaks in the action throughout the late afternoon and evening. And we'll do that again for Friday as flooding concerns will continue with those counties, Columbia, Alachua, and Putnam through 8 o'clock Friday night. Chances for showers and storms begin to wind down what has been widespread activity here throughout the work week. Turns more to the isolated and scattered activity here. Scattered showers, isolated storms, a pattern through the weekend. And then the summertime heat returns low to mid 90s as we look ahead to the upcoming work week. And you can always look ahead to the upcoming work week and beyond our weather authority forecast. It's always a click away at News for Jacks.